Hello everyone, uh, thank you for watching this video. Well, uh, right now we are two foreigners, uh, peer persons living here right now in China, uh, doing some business, doing some uh, jobs, doing several projects that we are making here right now in this the mainland Asiatic country that is really very beautiful and really, really well developed is China. So right now, I'm right now with Respect Maskut. He's the businessman who is making uh, several things here in China are also contributing several parts to Mongolia. So the, uh, this is a uh, many main interview and may so speaking about uh, the things of life here in China. So you can uh, ask, uh, you can share your experience here in China right now. Yeah, uh, thank you for your being here. Um, my name is Yuri Spick, as uh, my friend told. So, uh, I can ask first you, first to ask some yes. questions. Uh, yeah, so Manuel, uh, how much does it cost to live in China? Well, uh, right now, this is, I will answer you this kind of question. Well, right now, in, this is depending what you're doing here in China, uh, which kind of jobs are you doing, which kind of life you want to decide to stay here in China, right? Mm -hmm. Well, uh, depending also about the cities, the for example the Dombe part, uh, it means the North. northern part uh, is not so expensive, but too much foreigners who wants to live in Beijing, Shanghai, or Shenzhen, uh, Xinjiang, yeah, yeah, because uh, such kind of uh, cities and places are really attractive for foreigners, right? Um, also, is making too much development with enterprise and opening things to the uh, world. Uh, right? Yes. Uh, about the salary, uh, yeah. everyone here is living good. Is living good, right? Uh, everyone happy. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Happy. Uh, the, all the people here are eating. Uh, here they don't have uh, no sort of such kind of problem like. Uh, uh, food. Uh, however, is uh, all the people here should need to work here. The employment part is really big. Also open for everyone. Of course, <coughs> uh, for the foreigners, uh, should need to have an, uh, some adapt adaptation here to, to uh, for trying to be part of the enterprises, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah, so another thing about uh, what's the best place to uh, live in China, for example, you said in South, North, we can like everything, but uh, in South, South many cities like uh, Shanghai, you say Kanju, Xinjiang, or Beijing, right? So which cities, uh, what's the best city living in China uh, for living cost? Well, I think uh, living in uh, all the cities and province they have uh, advantage and disadvantage, right? Yeah. Uh, this is depending what you like and what you want to archive yeah. right now. Yeah. Uh, for example, it for example, for example, I think you've been in the Shanghai two yeah. days ago. So can you share us about your experience in Shanghai, the living cost yes. compared to harvest no, no China? Well, uh, I want to suggest to you something about uh, the cities. Uh, Shanghai is a city really attractive and too much people, too much Chinese people like uh, Shanghai because they think this is the first city and that uh, to, they have all the opportunities to do. This is the dream of this city. So. Uh, I think the best city is whatever you want and uh, what, whatever you want to do right now. Yeah, and this, uh, yeah, yeah. So, uh, so we are in Harbin in China, it's the uh, north of China, right? So what, uh, what about here in China, it's Harbin city? Uh, is it possible to work in China? Uh, for foreigners? Yeah. Or for what kind of jobs uh, is possible for foreigners? Well, main, the main job for foreigners here in China is uh, there are like two or three positions. For example, to be teacher at the first position, too much schools 
here are looking for a the foreigners that can show also the language, the culture part because China wants one. They have one mission to try to expand to the world and be known uh, by all the the world, the global part. Yeah. Right. Yes. This is uh, a huge, massive country, right? Yes. The first part is teacher. The second part is to uh, uh, to uh, making import export. Trading commercial I'm trading. Like commercial things. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Export. yes. Uh, because you know in China uh, they make there are too much industry, they make uh, products uh, and also they want to export, export to the whole world. Right? Yes, yes. Yeah, also the transportation is world the world, right? Yes. Yeah. Uh, the third part is trying to uh, uh, find this uh, knowledge. Uh, there's a preparation that China is not doing. For example, in the social part of sports, for example, in China it's not really well developed the, uh, for the world of baseball. And of course, there are other countries like uh, South America, maybe we can make reference to this. And football uh, uh, is really well developed, such kind of thing. But such kind of details. They need here to China. Yeah. So the, uh, what is the salary? It's like uh, between two thousand to three thousand, but it depends on the city, right? Also. Yes. This is depending about the cities. Of course, in Shanghai, the uh, this uh, first cities, uh, the salary is really high. It's really high for. Of course, the life is expensive, uh, but in living province, you're all. It, it is around 10, more than 10,000 for one professional person. Yeah. Like this. Yeah. And in the, in the province, yeah. it can be like 5,000. Like it in, in uh, 5,000 yuan, it means like $400, uh, uh, $400 or $500. For and that, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah uh, in such kind of cities, there is like one thousand five hundred dollars, like this, for right? yeah, so uh, this is the salary. Uh, but, uh, but this is depending about which uh, kind of I things think, you are doing. Yeah, yeah. So uh, another things were important for foreigners who is coming. China is China really safe? You think? Well, <clears throat> China is. Well, it's too really safe. It, it is one of the most countries, the most countries safe in the world right now. Uh, because right now they're controlling the, the security really well. And so safety. Uh, yes, yes. People here don't have such kind of, of manner or intentions to uh, get robbed or somebody. Also, uh, it contributes that people don't have. Uh, there is. Uh, forgiven uh, or not ever like to have weapons and in China. Yes. Like. Oh, yes. However, uh, I think they are just good doing a good example of model of security for uh, the cities. Yeah. Also, of course, in the cities sometimes uh, they have problems, but they don't have such kind of uh, criminal, like homicides, uh, murdery, uh, just really shocking for the society. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So it's just really safe. It's really safe. I think so. And you can leave one stuff outside, and just nobody will stole that stuff. So yeah, uh, another thing. So, what is the Chinese lifestyle like, if you compare it to your country? Ah uh, well, I uh, think in the Chinese style life is the first manner is the culture of work, <laughs> the culture of job. Hard working. Yeah? Yes, yeah. there uh, most of people here are really busy, busy with uh, jobs, with busy with doing something about that. Always there is doing something because here there is too much activities here in China. So uh, the life activity of course too much people uh, there are two billion of people live here living. Yeah. Uh, the lifestyle is of uh, is really 
big complex about that, but it's good manner. And what do you think about the Chinese people in the end? At the end? Uh, just I mean, okay, it's kind of in so and so. What do you think about the Chinese people? Uh, how are the Chinese people? Well, re they are really polite with the people. Re they have uh, good education, good manners to uh, to meet another person. Uh, I think uh, they have good part, good part things of China, life, society here. And yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah, no. yeah, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. Okay. Thank you for uh, watching this video. Okay, thank you for watching also this See you week. next time. Okay, that's all. Uh, I hope <coughs> you can leave some comments below here in this part of the video. And if you want, you can share uh, this video for and write your opinions about the life here in China. If you have some questions, ask them and I will answer you. So that's all. Goodbye. Thanks Goodbye. for watching Thank this you. video.